What's good, TMG fam? It's your boy L. I'm back with another reaction, man. How y'all feel? Welcome back to the channel. Salute. Now, listen, man. Heavily, heavily requested dude right here, Nardwar. I, I think that's how you pronounce his name. I'm not sure, but you guys have been on me saying, yo, I need to check him out, check his video out. So we here, right? This joint here is called Rappers Mind Blown by Nardwar Part One. Um, I had to look him up, bro, to see like who is this dude, man. I seen the channel. Uh, crazy views so he's he's well known just not by me i guess you know what i mean but he he's an interviewer and songwriter from uh i want to say british columbia so i was like i was like all right let me check him out man the views is crazy dude might be super funny we're gonna give him we're gonna, we gonna give him a check out you know what i mean we're gonna give him a check a, a check out all right so if you're new to the channel man hit the subscribe button join the fam and uh let go. Oh, Tyler, could you please tell us Canada? Is your mom half Canadian? Yeah, her. What the fuck? How do you know this shit? <laughs> yeah, my mom's mixed. Yo, shit. What the fuck? <laughs> you, with the, you with the feds, nigga? What exactly is going on in this photo? Right here. Oh, whoa. Good godness. <laughs> this is middle school, and I was probably at the school taking a selfie. Own a tobacco field in North Carolina. What's going on with that? I do. That's crazy. That's funny. I do. I have some land in, uh, in North Carolina that uh, <laughs> I knew it was going to be weird. I knew you were going to ask me freaky ass questions. How are the fields doing, and how could they do better? Um. <sighs> Uh, Random. <laughs> I don't, He's smacking everybody across the teeth right now with his questions, bro. I like his style. I like his style. No, I don't really. I don't really go to North Carolina that often, so I don't really deal with that with the land. He thrown off. Not to mention, probably high as a kite right now. Over there. That's so funny. That's such a weird question. Grinder, weren't you, Jimmy? Were you a grinder? <laughs> I was grinding. You know stuff like how do you know stuff like that? <laughs> he can be grinding on the floor of the skating rink. People about this VHS cassette right here. I was curious, did you put this out? Oh my Kev. This is what the fuck I've been trying to find. My Smoke Fest Volume One. This is the first one I ever put out, cuz. Find this. Look, this is the first one that I put out. This is my first movie that I directed, put up the money for. Shot it. See what it say on the back? Writer, director, and executive producer, Snoop Doggy Dog. You don't even have a copy yourself? No, I don't. We have right here and That's crazy, bro. First of all, how did you not have a copy? That's crazy. That's crazy. You don't even have a copy of your own work. That's weird is how is he? I'm intrigued. He got me drawn in. I'm 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 glued. An original guitar crusher 45 free. <laughs> From 1963. <laughs> yo, yo, designer don't even talk, bro. He just makes sounds. <laughs> designer just did. <laughs> that was a whole sentence right there. Watch, bro. He don't even talk. He just makes sounds. Right here, an original guitar crusher 45 free. <laughs> From 1963. <laughs> You did? Yo, that's my grandfather, man. Yo, you crazy, man. You crazy, man. Shout out my grandfather. Get to our question, man. It's original, man. The king. Hell yeah, you dig? I appreciate you, Zana. We have right here for you a Remy Ma 12 inch. <laughs> Yo, you nuts, man. <laughs> Yeah, she love it. She love it, Remy Ma, for real. Important Wiz Khalifa of the Homewood Library. Oh man, Homewood Library. <laughs> Killerly Pharrell. About this joint right here, is this where it all started right here with the rump shaker? <laughs> Pharrell, is this where it started? Pharrell Williams, the rump shaker. Yeah. This is, this is, this is one of the most impressive interviews I've ever experienced in my life. Seriously. Oh, well, thank you so much. It's great to be able to talk to you guys. This is, this is insane, man. Do you see this? <laughs> in California. <laughs> hey, bro, dude messing the walk right now. He crazy. For you. 
Now that might make you kind of hungry. What about Louisiana chicken? <laughs> that's the, yeah, Louisiana chicken. That's the neighborhood. Yeah, that's my that's my favorite. Yeah. And it's like bulletproof glass. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Kilo Ali, Sammy Sam, Foundation with Wuda Kid and Waka Flocka. Flame. <laughs> when you guys were growing up. How the fuck did he find this Kilo Ali? <laughs> That's crazy. Tiger striped <coughs> pit bull. Rima Major. That's what we called Rima Major. A tiger striped pit bull. But you just fucked me up. Like, how did y'all just go? <laughs> yo, yo, he messing their heads up right now. Look, look at Walker whole face, bro. Look at Walker whole face. Look, 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 look. That's how you know you got him messed up. You're throwing off right now. He's looking at you crazy like, bro, do I know you? Like, are we fit? Like, how did, how do you, he got him messed up. <coughs> Pitbull. Rima Major. That's what he called Rima Major. A tiger striped Pitbull. But you just fucked me up. Like, how did, yo, this guy's really on it, man. Yo, Rima's a pit. For you guys, lastly here from Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, a cool G-Rap puzzle. Let me see this. Just open this up. I fuck with you. <laughs> oh, oh, man, I drop the mic. Uh, All <laughs> right. So we cool now. I got you a puzzle. You the man. Yeah, man. I fuck with you. About Machine Gun Kelly and Anti Flag, and now the autographed rap. Yo, look at Machine Gun Kelly, bro. You the man. Yeah, man. I fuck with you. He look young as hell right here. Look at Machine Gun Kelly, bro. Uh, and salute to Machine Gun Kelly out here with the Megan Fox, bro. And you got when when props is due, you gotta give his man his props. Much respect. Machine Gun Kelly and Anti Flag, and now the autographed record. Man, dude, this was probably one of my favorite bands growing up. That definitely like huge influence on me in middle school. I fought to get this record, like the theme song for our DVD we have coming out. And um, God, dude, this is fucking nuts, man. Thank you. <laughs> I fucked your dame, and she bought me a. Motherfucking chain. <laughs> a chain. And I was thinking, Mr. Ferg, chains. You make the chains. Oh, sh wow. that's good. He know that. That was so long ago. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I used to make chains. I used to make jewelry. <laughs> and I guess I was curious, ASAP, what is the importance of the Black Ink Gallery? Um, wow. How the fuck do you know about the Black Ink Gallery? Okay, Black Ink Gallery is a tattoo shop in Harlem where we all used to just hang out at 113th. And, you know, that was just like one of the clubhouses. We got a, a bunch of them, several of them. And Ferg, your dad used to do stuff for Bad Boy? Uh, he designed the Bad Boy logo for Puff. Yeah, what did he do? What else did he do? Are you still in contact with him at all? That's amazing. Uh, my father actually passed away, but he did the Uptown Cast logo for Andre Harrell also. And he did Big Picnics too that everybody loves? Wow. Yes, he did. Same gang picnics. It's amazing having Ferg in the crew. <laughs> You're a fucking son. That's crazy, but even more crazy is his pops did the bad one, the Uptown, like, that's dope, man. You know what I'm saying? And that's a lot of pressure too, man. My pops did all this. I'd be like, yo, I got that. I gotta do something. <laughs> I gotta do something out here. Psychic genius. Of one of your early influences right here. Oh, oh, oh. How the fuck I did you know that? How did you know that? Thong song. Yo. How the fuck did you know that, yo? Oh, yo, real shit. Real shit. There's probably instrumental version there. You can rap over now. Oh, oh shit. shit. We're gonna kill this. Travis Scott, did you have a teacher called Mrs. Rear? Whoa, my Spanish teacher? Is it from high school? Yeah, <laughs> she had the big titties. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it's messed up, but hey, how you remember somebody is how you remember somebody. It's certain things that, you know, make a first impression on you and a lasting impression, and maybe that was it for a Spanish teacher, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is that her? That's what I was curious about. Yeah, yeah. Now I remember she was my Spanish teacher. Yeah, and she was actually Spanish. I wonder where the fuck she's at. That's fucking crazy. How the fuck you know that, bro? You're Travis Scott. We have to know. It's fucking crazy. Yeah. And Travis, what exactly is going on in this photo right here? <laughs> Holy shit! 
<laughs> now, you're really into the wrestling, aren't you? Yeah, I love wrestling. I love wrestling. What was that video you saw, like, hypnotized dance party? What was that? Like, hypnotized in the ring? Some wrestlers getting hypnotized in the ring? Like, you look like watching. I know what you're talking about. I know what you're talking about. Remember that shit? Shit, the dancing shit. I ain't talking about yeah. the fuck, yo. Yeah. What the fuck is wrong with you, man? Why are you bringing back shit I forgot about, man? <laughs> what was that? That's amazing. Tell the people about that. You gotta tell it, because my memory is fucking. 27 hours to... I don't know. Memphis! Oh, Memphis. Oh, man, yeah. Class. Shelby Drive. Shelby Drive, baby. That's White like... Haven. White Haven. What? <laughs> oh, man, yeah. I think they play some significance in your lives. What can you tell the people about Little Brother and Big L? Oh, man, <laughs> man this is amazing. I, tell you that I think I have this record. You definitely have that record. Thanks for having me here. And you, Ugly God, were born at 123? What the fuck? Yes, I was born at one, two, three. Like, yes. That's crazy time to be born at one, two, three. One, two, three. You was born at one twenty three. That's crazy. I would always walk around like I'm destined for something. God. One twenty three PM September nineteenth, nineteen ninety six. How you Well, you are ugly God. We have to know. Yes. Shout out to Kevin Walden. What? Oh, my high school, my best friend. Yes, yeah, shout out to him. I don't know. God, shout out to him. And Caleb. What? <laughs> <laughs> that's not even on the internet. It got to be somebody close to the camp that's feeding this dude this information, bro. Or he's a hell of a researcher. Like a, like a research guy. God, bro. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't know, man. I got to move him up the rankings and, and interviewers. He's up there, bro. What he's doing, he's completely throwing people off. Anywhere. So I don't... Wow. Shout out to my homies. And I don't know how the fuck you knew that. <laughs> <laughs> you are ugly, God. We have to do it. God. I guess so, man. That, that's weird. I don't know how you found that out. I don't even think that's even on the internet anymore. And they're in college, so I don't, I'm not even with them anymore. So I don't know how to fuck. Thank you, Brett. Brett. Well, my childhood. You talk about Brett when I was a little kid? Shout out, Brett, man. I don't know where you are. All I know is that you moved to Italy. And actually, Brett taught me how to catch lizards, bro. When I was like three or four years old. Or like probably four or five. Monica followed. Quote, Monica follow. Monica follow, Monica, I don't know. Monica follow me. What's that? One of your old tracks, it is genius. A Jaron track. Ta oh shit. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh my God. I remember that song. There's just a girl I was trying to get to follow me. And I wrote your uncle at one time, did he run hip hop, fish and chicken in Tallahassee? <laughs> Yeah, how you be knowing all this? <laughs> it's been, I'm gonna keep the family stuff out. This, but, like, like, you good, man? I like you. Like 130 something suspensions. And you spend a lot of time drawing a sun into the corner of the pages. How did you? How, whoa, whoa. Okay, you're going too far now. You're going too far. Like, like that's some stuff I used to do in like first grade. Like all of them in the corner of the top pages, it would just be a sun just written at the. <laughs> it's crazy. It's crazy. That's crazy, bro. Where do you get this information? You are Tory. <laughs> I'm Tory Lanez. And we have to know. You have to know. I got, I get, I, 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 this is crazy. Hey, yeah, oh. Yo, bro. Hey, hey. If you an interviewer out here and you, you got to step your game up. I, I've been exposed to one of the greats right now. You got to step your game up if you out here. Nardwar, he's out here blowing people's minds, fam. Blowing people's minds right now. Like, got him completely, like, almost vulnerable in a sense. It was it was scary what he was doing. The way he disarmed people, the way he made them feel like that's top-notch skill set. Hey, hey, he got a skill set, bro. But y'all get at me in the comment section. Leave your boy a like, man. And get at me in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. Leave a like, share the video, subscribe, and stick around and stay tuned. To the next reaction, man. I'm out. Peace. Y'all stay solid. Hey.